super early, early, early morning for me. It's like 4.20 a.m. See if everything is looking good. Oh. See. Said it before, say it again. I really need to, to uh, figure out how to automate more of this stuff. Have a way to do it. I just don't know. Just don't know. Oh, it is what it is. Everything seems to be up and running, I think. Was something I was going to do? I think I was going to do something, but I think I also forgot what I was going to do. Since I can't remember, it's pretty obvious that I forgot what I was going to do, but yeah. Anyway, today I'm just going to carry on with some quests. It's Shoreline, that's the place where we go. We need to kill 10 scavs while wearing these these items and the uh, suppressed weapon. So I got a few suppressed weapons ready. I'm just gonna kill some scavs and maybe drop by the resort towards like the, the end of the runs. Some water. Let me see if I got some food in the. Hello. Oh, I got some condensed milk though. Maybe some tea. Tea in peace. I'll just buy a candle. All right, all right, all right. What was I supposed to remember? Aha. I think I just remembered what I was supposed to do. Let's see, we did this. What was what I was supposed to do? Wearing the cap today to look young. Oh, that's really not really the reason why I'm wearing it, but. Put myself there. I was just opening my Discord. All right. Oh, got food and water. Anything else I need? I got eggs. I got the marker because I need to mark the thing at the the resort. If I can the last medical container. Let's try it. See how it goes. Louder show alarm, boys. <laughs> My prediction is that um, I will most likely As long as I kill some scavs along the way, I should be good. Like, I only need to kill 10 scavs for two parts of the quest, and I gotta find some MREs. I need to figure out where those load. Like, not the, the green MRE thingy, but the brown ones. It's been a month now. It's been a fun month. I was away over the weekend, and a few days extra, doing some ice fishing. I'm also gonna go away after this weekend. Probably even on Tuesday, and I'll probably be gone for a long time, so I'm trying to get in a few streams here and there before I go. So I'll probably be streaming, uh, unless I go away for the week, and I should be doing it every day until, um, until like, I leave on Tuesday. Yeah. My last stream will be, like, Monday, late Monday, or late Monday my time, which is... At UTC plus one, I think. Something like that. Central European time. C18. 
then I'll be gone for a while because I'm gonna go, probably go back home. It's ride around on my snowmobile and do some ice fishing. We'll see. Should be fun. So how's everyone doing today on this fine morning? Oh, it's not really a morning yet. Hey, how are you doing? Digits. It's probably starting to get late over there now. Around 10, 8, 10, somewhere around there, depending on the time zone you are. Well, here it's 4 in the morning. Well, it's taking a long time with the players. Ah, turns out, yeah, yeah, yeah. About time getting ready for bed then. Oh, well, it all depends on how late you go to bed. I usually go to bed pretty early. Sometime between 10 and 12 is usually my bedtime. Usually. It depends. Sometimes you stay up later. Sometimes you uh, don't go to bed earlier. Probably never. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I never go to bed around like before 10, I think. Unless I'm super tired. I might have. Yeah. But usually it's in between, between 10 and, well, this time to be exact. But I was in bed at 11 now. So I've only slept for like four, five hours. That should be good. I just woke up because it was, I forgotten to open my window, so it was hot as balls. And thus, I couldn't sleep anymore. So now I'm just keeping my window open, gaming a little bit, and uh, it's probably going to be cold as balls pretty soon. Since I am in the wintry lands of northern Norway. Alright, so where is this spawn? Oh yeah, it's up there with the fence thing. Alright, alright, I know where I am. Think. There's the resort, yeah, I don't know where I am. Got a spawn ahead of me. Think. I think there should be a stash around here somewhere. Oh, there you go. At the shoreline. Shoreline, because you got the resort right up there. Which is where all the beefy boys go and fight. And I kind of need to go to shoreline too. Or not the shoreline, but the resort. So I have quests I need to do there. But I'm also scared of the chats. Because they also hit up the resort. But I guess at this point it's just a matter of do or die, right? Trying to move a little bit more carefully, but uh... We'll see, we'll see what happens. We'll see, we'll see. There are any chats, wait a minute. <laughs> Weird. Getting like little stutters. Oh, it might be the ping.
It's in the listening a little bit. I'm probably just gonna get domed from somewhere pretty soon. been in this basement before. This is admin. Thank you. Oh yeah, this is the place where all the people congregate anyway. So I just get a do or die, I guess. Nah, it's probably in here in the resort somewhere. I just need to visit this place for a quest. So now I got that quest done. I'm just listening for noises. It's really quiet. I don't like when it's quiet. Yeah, usually it's like a lot more action in here. I think. Then again, I've only been here like two or three times and died.
heard some noise. Oh. Awfully quiet. I got my quest done, so I could just bail. Or try to get more quests done. I think I'm just gonna bail. Loot some more, then get out. Yeah. Hard decisions, you know. What scares me is the fact that I can't hear anybody. Tunnel, which means I need to go out west. Maybe I should try to go out and mark the container. It's time, huh? But the container is super exposed, also, so, um, yeah, decisions, decisions. Something I gotta get better at in this game. above me. Hmm. Heard him unlock a door. Then I haven't seen him since, or heard from him since. It scares me. Trying to listen if I can hear anything from him. Because I know he's up there. Just don't know where. I 
it goes again. Unlocking doors. Now this is a risky player for my quest. Especially since I know there's a dude above me. I'm scared. I just, I'm scared. <laughs> now this is where I die. I would kill that scab, but uh, oops. <laughs> Thought I hit him enough to kill him, but uh, apparently I didn't. Oh well, 188 damage to the body. All right. Oh, my bad. That was unfortunate. Headized by the buckshot. I should have been more aggressive. I should, probably should have sprayed him more. And also, when he, once he got behind the pillar, I should have just moved away and, uh, like, had a little more left. Because when the scav, when the scav's got an eye on you, they're probably going to head eyes you like that. So I need to move and reposition. No, which I didn't, which got me killed. So it's, uh, it's just a bad play by me. But I think I might have completed some quests anyway. Hey, how you doing, Patches? You joined just at the wrong time. Ah, cool, cool, cool. Is Peacekeeper had the quest done? No. Mechanic? Yeah, mechanic. Cool. So I got that quest done. Oh, alright, alright. Yeah, I heard you say you had your last raid. I just got on. Since it's not night for me, well, at night, morning, it's, it's four in the morning. Was the stream good? Did you get some good raids in? Oh, for sure, for sure. I'll probably be playing a little bit. Ah, oh, nice, nice. That's good, that's good. Put that GPU in my farm. Nice, nice. What's this one for? ACP. Well, that's expensive. Which gun skin is this use? 506. Oh, it's say yeah, you need that, that thingy. I'll just sell them. Cool, cool, cool. I need the space. I just gotta sell it. Rip that I have for this one. Here I got the grips. Green, maybe. It's the one.
Oh, I, I need to do the peacekeeper. Blue man. Oh, I don't know. I don't know. Uh, I actually have no idea. I'm going to stay on for like three hours today and uh, do some regular stuff. And I uh, probably around, if I get on tomorrow, around six, eight my time, I think. So around between probably 12 and 2 your time. Somewhere around then. If everything goes according to plan. Ah, cool, cool, cool. Yeah, hopefully we'll get, it'll be fun to get some games in during the weekend. That would be cool. Because I'll just be, uh, I think I'll be playing a lot over the weekend. And especially on Monday, I'll probably, probably play a lot. Early Monday and late Monday. Because Tuesday I'm going to go uh, back home for some snowmobile riding. So that's going to be... That's going to be nice. Can't use that one against that one. Yeah, it's going to be. It always is. It always is when I go back home and get to play around in my snowmobile and also do some ice fishing, which is one of my favorite pastimes, so it's a win-win for me. Probably got some more food. Can I buy some food from this? Not. Where can we find provisions? Food. What's the cheapest food? None of it's cheap. Junko is the cheapest. Hey, how you doing, Cupan? I've been up home, back home, riding my snowmobile and having a great time. Just enjoying life, doing the fun stuff. And relaxing. I was away for over the weekend and a couple of extra days. Just doing some ice fishing. Enjoying the weather. It's been sunny and nice up here, so. <laughs> uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. No, fortunately, I have not been getting real sick and stuff. I miss you too, buddy.
Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, I was sick. And I also had to do uh, get a COVID test this Monday. The fact that the guy that uh, I ran out of room in my apartment to this guy, and he uh, he works at the school, and the school got infected. And uh, but I'm I'm feeling good. The test was negative. I didn't have the COVID, fortunately. It was just being back home, ice fishing, enjoying the life. And I'm also gonna go like after this weekend on Tuesday. I'm gonna go back north. Uh, back home, visit my family and everything again because my sister's having a baby so I'm going to be an uncle again that's cool so I'm going to stay, stay up north a little bit chill with the families, I probably won't be streaming for a few weeks instead I'll be hanging with the family and other than that, being out in the outdoors Enjoying the hopefully good weather and catching some fish. That should be fun. Still can't believe I died to that scout the last raid. All the things to die to, it had to be a scav and the head eyes with the buckshot. <laughs> I was more worried about the, the guy that was in resort with me that I couldn't find. Now where's this one? I think this is next to swamp. Yep, it's swamp. So, I should go towards the village because I need to do like the cottage thing. Quest there. To get Sanitar's ophthalmoscope. So, I got the key for the cottage. And I kind of want to hit up resort late so that hopefully people will be gone. Hopefully. Playing it safe. Not want to go slogging through the swamp. Let's see, let's see. So how was your stream today, Cupan? I tuned in for a little bit earlier. You guys were fighting some uh, chungus as an interchange. Ah, oh, nice, nice, nice. It's good to hear, good to hear.
Playing it super safe because I'm still learning this uh, map. Who am I kidding? I probably would play it super safe anyway. <laughs> I'm just running around super scared whenever I play solo. Because I'm just expecting people to be around every corner. I guess it's a normal thing to be, be scared of when you like you don't know the map with the spawns and everything. Like where usually people will congregate. Oh, for sure, for sure. So quiet here. Yeah, probably. I'll be live earlier. Well, earlier your time. So around the time when you're at work, when I usually play. I just woke up because it was super hot in my room, so I decided to just get on right now. It's like four and five in the morning right now. So normally I'm sleeping at this hour. Cool, cool. I hope you have a good one too. And thanks for stopping by.
I think I'm alone in the village. I'll find out soon enough. Handrail. A plug. And a toss. You sleep tight and have a good day. And I'll see you when I see you. No oh, forky. No zibo. Now comes the scary part. Which is trying to visit the cottages. Time is at thirty nine, all right. came from behind me. In case I encounter somebody, let's juice up. Get the butt cheeks lubed up and ready. One scab down. Quest item. And the safe.
Huh. That's not cool. Sounded pretty close. So somebody's around here. They know I'm inside. It's not good for me. Skirt. Got my quest items, I kind of just want to get out with the quest items. Should probably just try to book it. Now let's try to do that. Thought I could un exit that door. Apparently I couldn't. Right, let's just book it. I'm too chubby. I don't regen stamina when I'm walking. Too much weight. A 
let's lose the Taz. Or not. Yeah, man. <laughs> Gotta get that energy up. usually a scab around here somewhere. I don't see nobody. Still a lot of action at the resort. Up by gas and see if we can maybe pop a scab or two. Probably also look at power. Okay, so what time do I have? 28 minutes. It's still good time, still good time. Eight more scabs to go. scab over there which means somebody passed by here or might be down at the pier so this could wind up with me dying so I just gotta go for it see what happens Do or die. Or die and do. Alright, I didn't see nobody. I'm to regen some stamina. I think maybe I'm gonna sneak up to resort. Or should I just take my quest items and go? I just have the one quest item. I have a little bit of loot, not a lot of bit of loot. So 
questions you have again. Hmm. The sessions, the sessions. Let's move on up towards power and see if I can catch another scav. Maybe I'll be lucky and catch a scav out, or maybe I'll just get popped in the dome. Welcome to Tarkov. This is super exposed and I'm feeling vulnerable. check the stash under the bridge see what happens there I get some good loot That's towards road to customs. That's a big gun. I don't want to mess with a big gun. Now I'm kind of scared again. Let's get some food in the belly. And some water. Just to level the scales. And let's use some mats. 
in case I get into fighting. Right. It's pretty late in the game now. Oh. It's a big gun. I'm kind of hoping there won't be anybody up here. That's my hope and dreams. Scav up here at least. There's somebody right outside my hut. Player scavs, most likely. Oh no, the big gun guy came here. Why though? It's kind of hoping he wouldn't. Got time. I think. Maybe. Please let me place this. I don't care if you kill me afterwards, I just want to place this. There's the last marquee thingy I need. I don't need to survive after doing this, I just need to get out. Cool.
Buongiorno, Natsuka. I'm super nervous. So I got that quest item. I gotta get over there. Now this is the part where I die. Because I'm gonna sprint over what they call the suicide hallway. Which means I'm gonna die. Alive. That was the wrong room. That was not smart. Making all the noise. Okay, now I just need to GTFO. I need to hit a road to customs. All right, here goes. Carrying too much loot. <laughs> That's unfortunate. Somebody's on the way towards my extract shooting. Which might mean that somebody is camping the extract. I'm gonna try to wrap around the outside. And I'll play him that way. But it's starting to get short on time. I don't have a lot of stamina. Which other ones to cut up potentially have? Rock passage is probably closed. I'm not gonna gamble on that.
We'll see, we'll see. If I get out now, I'll be super happy. Since I got a lot of quests done. If I die, doesn't matter. I'd still have fun. Even though I didn't encounter any PMCs. What I'm kind of gambling on is that people have gotten all the loot they wanted and have just extracted. That's kind of what I'm betting on. So everybody's just fat and jolly with loot and just left the map so it's just... Just me now. So I can slowly but surely make my way back to the extract and get out safely. <sighs> I think this is what I love the most about this game is it gets me super nervous. That was still in an enjoyable way, you know. My adrenaline is up. But it's a taxing game to play for a long amount of time, I think. So like the bigger stream, we should play this for 10, 12 hours. I'm not sure I even could. It's probably something you get used to though. Like after doing it for a while you get desensitized to more of the all the things that I now I'm like super nervous about it. Like, yeah, this is just part of the game, you know. You just done it done it so many times, went through it so many times, it's like it doesn't matter. You see people doing that, but it's like I'm just so tense when I'm playing it. That's why I'm thinking I'm I'm gonna have a hard time like playing it for 10, 12 hours straight. Just because of how tense I get. But then again, with raids taking like 30 minutes or 30 minutes is a short one, of like 20 to 50, depending on what you do. It also is like you're, you're gonna be getting a long stream no matter what because the raids in themselves take take a long time. Now I'm gonna be get popped in the dome. Please don't shoot me. Let me leave. <laughs> oh, thank the lords in heaven. <laughs> Oh yeah, 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 I played other games, like I played, uh, you, you used to play a lot of Hearthstone Valley runs too, and I can play that game easy for like 10 hours. I also played Final Fantasy on stream, and I was also good, good to go for like 10, 12 hours. No problem. So the Shimmy Jan, it's, it's just that with this game, I'm I'm so tensed up, so I feel it in my shoulders now. So I'm just tensing my time, because I'm focused so much, I'm just tensing my body. This is something that I'm also pretty sure is going to go away. The more you get used to the game, uh, when you know the maps a lot better, you're not as nervous. And when you've been in all kinds of fights, like some of these people, I played for multiple wipes, so they, they played this for years. I've only played it for a month. <laughs> I've never actually played Kingdom Hearts myself. 
I've just seen it and Uncharted I've only played Uncharted 2 for a little bit so but they are great games for sure I've seen people play them they are great games and Kingdom Hearts I was I was always more fun fancy guy so I kind of like I, I never got into Kingdom Hearts for some reason but I used to watch my uh, my ex play it a lot All these quests. Yeah, some games are just that way. Where you, you can just keep going and going and going and going. And it's great. Now I need... Uh, First motor controller and some gyroscopes. <laughs> that's a long one, that's a long one. I used to watch a lot of speedrunning earlier, but I haven't haven't I never really like picked up a game and tried to go and like into speedrunning myself. I used to love watching it. Having more. But I enjoy long games. Like, I've always been an RPG guy. So I gotta kill Sanitar. Cool. Like I played a lot of Boulder Skate. Uh, those type of isometric RPGs. And enjoy him thoroughly. <laughs> really? Oh. I thought you might be like a... RPG can do it since you like old older games. Green key card. Do not kill the Xanatar. Yeah, 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 that's uh that's the PlayStation games, yeah. Ah, alright, alright, alright. Let me just check the quest. Colleagues, part three. That's a lot of stuff you got to give away. Let's see what the cost on the flea. Blue. Yeah. I'm definitely not given doing that quest. <laughs> you like more like fast-paced-ish combat. Well, again, you, you you do like speedrunning games, so I can understand that you would prefer uh, prefer games that have more clicks, if you will. You know, like more more buttons. It kind of makes sense, you know.
more APM action to men, basically, where you get to, you get to do more stuff. M80. This one I can keep. Plug I can sell. The Keck I can keep. Fcom I sell. Sell that. Is that worth anything at all? Okay. Yeah, I grew up with the, the Nintendo. The good old NES. I think I need a request. Is worth anything at all? That's probably not worth anything. <laughs> uh. I was super lucky with uh, the games I got when I was a kid. My parents got me um, Ghosts and Goblins, and I've never beat that game. And I'm pretty sure I never will beat that game. But I've seen it being speedrun, so... Yeah, that's the thing when you're playing those kind of games as a kid. It's like, all right. So, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. It's a, it's a tough game from what I've seen in speedruns. And especially I can imagine me being a kid and when I actually get through the game and it just like the first time you get through it, you just go like, oh, this was just a trick. You need to do it again. I would probably be so devastated. Yeah, I'm never going to play it. <laughs> I'm done with that. <laughs> Let's see, which tasks do I have now? Shoreline, I need to lower half masks. Of course, I forgot to do that. Uh -huh. Truck with lost UN cargo. Let's check that quest. You met... Aryan supplies. Supplies. CCP temp. And backside of resort. Right. All right. All right. Yeah, for sure. That game, uh, yeah, that game will, uh, yeah, no. <laughs> I'm not, I'm just not, I don't, don't want to go back to living through that. <laughs> I think I got some loot from them. Oh, I shouldn't have claimed those. But I like those hard games too. It's something I miss from my like childhood with playing that. It's like games that are you can't beat them. They're just gonna be very difficult. So it's a it's a challenge and gets you going. I enjoy that. Well, yeah, that's the that's the that's the weird ass the Super Mario, right? It's like a little bit different. It was made by, it was wasn't that one that was basically just a game that got made into Mario. It was originally another game, and they just made it and skinned it into Mario or something. 
Was that the one? Or am I thinking about something else? Oh, all right, all right, all right. That's probably the one I was thinking of then. Let's see, I'm fully healed. Ah, yeah, yeah, yeah that's on the Doki Doki, Doki Panic. <laughs> oh, yeah. It's like all kinds of crazy. Need to bring two markers. I'll risk an IFAC. A poor. Two. Bayo. Should kind of bring a jam or two. Let's do that, so then I can get on. Don't I have, I think I should have a jam or somewhere, there we go. And I can probably try to get on the roof, but I need to bring some painkillers. Let's just risk it. Yeah. Yeah, I played that. We we rented that game when I was a kid, me and my sister. She loved it. I couldn't stand it. I loved Super Mario 1 and Super Mario 3. Those were my jams. As well as Zelda, because I got Zelda when I was a kid. I love that game. And this puzzle game called Lulu. The Adventures of Lulu. A super fun game. That my father got, my father, dad, and mom, they both got addicted to the game. <laughs> like one time they just stayed up because it was a little fun puzzle game and they enjoyed it. So they just stayed up like all night playing the game and was super tired the day after, I remember. <laughs> like the old consoles got kids on them. <laughs> I never, I got Ocarina of Time later. And it was the original Zelda for the NES. And uh, actually, I've never finished Ocarina of Time myself either. But I played with friends to finish it. We used to play together, you know, on the one that was swapping around the controller and playing together. Yeah, 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 that's the one. Lulu. That's the one. Fun little game. And I also had this, uh, this cool game called Euphoria that I just loved. It was a weird, weird, weird game, though. We have like these main characters, Bob Louie, who at his attack is like sh shooting his head at people and he's on like a chain. And you got Shades who takes off his glasses and shoots his eyes. That kind of like a homing thing. Yeah, it's a nice game. It's a fun game. And then you had Gil, which was a green sluggy alien looking thing. He just vomited bombs so you can blow through walls. And then you had Leon was a lizard I could walk on ice and I think you could blow like some fire stuff it's a cool game called euphoria not euphoria but you or f o f o u r yeah euphoria it's a cool and fun game it's probably also like a reskin type thing and I remember I had from the Nintendo magazine I had like these uh Sashen uh, games from probably China, I guess. I don't know, like some, somewhere in Asia. Like these bootleg games, and they had like a millionaire game, which is basically Monopoly. And I used to play that a lot with my sister. I still love like the the ending theme to that game. Like when you beat it, it's a fun little, it's a fun little track. The NES had some banging music.
No, it's just called Millionaire. It was uh, it's sort of like a Monopoly skin. Swamp once more. Could... Could hit up the village. Or just hit the outskirts and go up. Maybe hit that sniper scare. I'll let you do that. Then hit the resort. No, no. I don't even know what game that is. Never heard of that game, brother. Yeah, 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 for sure, for sure. Yeah, that's the thing. It'll like called all kinds of different things. You got like different versions too, like NTSC and PAL. That was two different ones. That's some bright sun. I do love the weather effects in this game, like it. Makes the lame game look super good and nice. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah true. It's like the the convert how it how the image converts on the TV isn't that that like the connection. That is called. Like I always wish they just did like universal standards for everything. Like this is what we do. I like, come to an agreement. But I understand like the, the selling point of having your own thing so people can't use your proprietary stuff all right thanks for tuning in cool cool thanks thanks you have a good night's sleep i'll just be walking around trying to stay alive So are you well rested and ready for another day tomorrow? You conquer the world once more. Or just run around with like rugrats. K105. Let me just go and...
this boy scared me. I was focused on trying to... Wish I brought splints. I was trying to ban that guy. Can't do it from here, so I gotta. My OBS is. There we go. Need to fix my arm, which might get me killed. Hopefully, it won't be. Right, all right, all right. I survived that. Let's just pull back up OBS then. So, which quests then do we need to go behind resort and mark that truck? Is it behind resort? I think it's behind resort. It's at resort at least. It's not something I gotta do. And I needed to mark another truck down there. And of course, skill scaffs. my monitor settings Let's figure out, let's figure out what the play is. And I'm sorry if you tuned in, mister. What's your name again? Miglook. I just hit that stash and I was trying to ban some guy from my chat. Like spam bot. Then he just walked up. Unfortunate. He almost got me though because I was missing so many shots.
Reminds me. Let's, um... I think I'm safe here. Let's do this. This is gonna be an awkward play. Leveling skills, though. I just want to top that out pretty gold, Nick. That's what I got. The most amount of good shots loaded up. I left your stuff though, so you'll get that back from insurance. Ah, uh, then I actually took your Glock, oh, and the Glock is found in rain. Alright, never mind that. So I left your stuff. It was just a side gun, some stuff, but I don't know. Might be, might be good for you to get it back still. up some BT leveling some skills while we're stalling <laughs> it's kind of get you got to get used to just running in and running in and gunning you know but now I'm playing a sneaky because I'm trying to do the quests which needs to kill some scabs silenced with while wearing this blue thingy oh, those two different because I need to kill scabs silent Silenced, and I also need to kill scouts while wearing this one. So I'm just doing them both for one, both at the same time. Full clip of Igolnik. Walking up on the resort, ready to get my ass blasted. Oh, there's the truck. Scav. Did not have a lower half mask. So uh, now I just need to, I need to get anything more in here. I'm not sure. I need to kill Sanitar. I think I got all the quest items. So I could just go back out and work my way down to CCP Tamp and mark the last truck. Do some questing. Let's do that. Oh, 
Let me just check my map. Turn up around behind Weapons House. Wait for Rock Bridge. I can go between weather and radio. Go straight down. Let's try that. There's like a stash up here somewhere. Yeah. There. Let's go check it. Let's see if I can find it. Not get shot in my booty hole. Let me just look it up on the map real quick. Search for shoreline. Fourteen bushes. While I can see that one, all right. So it should be close to where I am. Spin heads. I'll do it by the dude that I killed. Weapon house. So going between here, my goal is to work my way down towards Rock Bridge area. And go between them just to go straight to CB Temporary. Doesn't need to go next to the crane. 
to my P1 truck. So that I can finish up this quest. At least this part of the quest. I'm a little bit worried that I'm gonna get some resort chats to come running down and pin me up. Uh, better risk the biscuit. Like who wants to live forever anyway? So that's weather, the right path, it's radio, should I hit a radio stash? I kind of got to go resort and jam that thing anyway, we'll do that next round. Let's just take to the quest on this one. I need to do the stashes near drone. Do that. I'll try to at least. Well, this is a dangerous one. Because I'm in the middle of the open right now. I'm targeted for getting sniped in the dome. I just gotta remember where these stashes are. stash I think six tactical sports I wasn't really worth that much and yeah, that's 19 and I know where the 21 is APSX can go straight up my booty hole. It's feeling a little bit more safe. Famous last words.
Too far down. Crane is over there. Missed it. That was a PMC. Might as well level skills.
Too much weight. Time, I'm getting time. Should we go check in? Fuck it, right? Leveling scales.
So if I extract from this one, turn out to be a good rate. Let's see if I can remember where this stash was. That's unfortunate. So I'm dead. But I got the quest complete, so I don't mind. Is there any of the loot that I want? I got the APSX, but that's on my bum bum, so that's cool.
дикие еще эти. Их только не хватало. Right. Oh, the supernova is towards the end there.
Nah, I didn't see him, so I didn't have a single shot. It might have been better if I had like a wound or something. What did I get hit with? Big game FMJ. And Golnik. Ooh. So the deuce just hit me the one time. Cool, cool, cool. Oh. It made me sweaty that raid. I was super nervous enough I didn't. I'm trying I'm gonna watch it back afterwards and see if I if I ever spotted them. Unless they shot me from somewhere, but I couldn't see. That's something that's struggling kind of with in this game. There's spawning enemies still. It's, but it's good to have something to work on, you know. It would be bad if I didn't, like, if I felt I had no weaknesses. That would mean I was just... That would mean I was just thinking I'm uh, better than I if you got something to learn, that means you got room to improve. It's good. And let's see, I knew I had like a second clip somewhere. Well, that's filled with the gold neck. Some load that and run BT in it. How much is APSX now? Oh, easy. Sells for that, it would be brilliant. Looks around, that's like. Well, uh, 1500. Well, let, let's just go do this straight away so we're done it. That done. I just need to find lower half masks, okay. It's done. Nothing. And then this time, nope. But Peacekeeper is complete. I still need to find MREs. Nothing I need to turn in. So I just need to find MREs. Rat quest. Good, good, good. Place the jammer. Go sham. Sanitar. We'll see, we'll see. Okay, one five. How much does it sell for? And three K. Let's check the It's been done. How much is the shrimp? Around twenty K. For mechanic it's twelve K, alright. Let's sell it for Mm 
loads. Didn't have any good. I don't know. I just PS. Sell out to the mechanic. I don't know if I need a tube for anything. Let's see, let's see, let's see. Sodium. Trash. JS probably has one crash. It's the Shimag. Do I need that for something? I think I need it for a quest. I'm not sure. Let's just keep it. No dealers, mechanic. Sell off the shitty ammo. Millie. Put it a hideout, get the graphics card out, and put it in my view farm. Oh, let me keep you for my Bitcoin farm. Could sell it for profit right now, but since I'm going away, might as well just keep them in the farm. Right. Now I'm done with this, so I don't need these anymore. It also means I can go there and change to some reveal clothes. Be more stealthy. Dealer's mechanic. Nope. Dealer's ragman. Alright, alright, alright. Cool. And thank the dudes towards the end there who just left me be. Appreciate it. You didn't have to leave me be, but you're dead. It's appreciated. Uh, I don't think I need to run silence to AKs anymore. Can I use this for? I can say the silencer's done because I got this serve thingies. Compensators. I know I have some compensators somewhere. I fit these. Doesn't remember where. Comp. For each case. The work comp. Which case? Yes, R V V V. AK and compile seven sixty two. I'm pretty sure I have like a hundred percent, but I'm pretty. Pretty sure. Then I could be wrong. In that case I just popped the silence back on the way. Gucci. See, I knew it was. Or these. Gives me a little bit more room. Means I can take. These two up there. Not that that does anything, but yeah. Health, we're good on health. Need to have food and water. Use 20 of you. Still need more food. 
I need to figure out which is the most like affordable food that I can just straight up buy. Well, I'm taking care of a lot of slickers and croutons for some trades. Oh, there's some herring. Eat all of that. There's two of you. All right, so I'm full on food and water. Got my money bag. Mm. Let's see, well, quests, what was that needed to do? Yes. Mine raid seven lower half masks. Kill 12 BMCs with grenades. Oh, I'm max level on a therapist. I can trade for that. Ledex. Can I buy some new stuff then? I can buy ibuprofen, that's nice. Okay, what I can buy now. Okay, key button, I'll need that. Can change paper map. Box case for that, key tool. Pistol case. Items case for euros. Ammo trade. Scav case. Pick. If that's a yeah, no. Money case trade, yeah. I can buy Grizzly. And I can buy the lab skate cards, yeah. That's cool. That's cool. Up par, I need one more level. Oh, look, what quests did I have from therapist? Just need to check this. Let's care privacy part three. Blood sample. Blood. Oh, should I next to that camp? All right. All right. All right. All right. Should be able to do that easily enough. The only bad part is like I need to go to woods. I do not like woods. Uh. Wi-Fi camera up here, go to port, Kiba. Here, that was down there, yeah. Got the vitamins. Peacekeeper, what's task I need to do I gotta find the MREs. So it's just doing stash runs, I guess. Let's see what's the best way of finding MREs. M-R-E Box Private cash, stats, gas, ground Sport bags Hmm Let me just check Is that east? Is... Well, now one, two, three. Guess I should have read that earlier. I still need to kill the, the thingy thingies. Two, three, turn in. Complete the quests. Spa tour. The cult part one. Kill seven scouts at the shoreline with 12 gauge shotgun headshots. 
All right, that's uh, it could be difficult. I think maybe. Let's see the cult. I just need to get wrapped on this guy, and I'm good. Hmm. This is one of the shoreline. What's up on the hill there? Alright, well that should be easy enough. That should be easy enough. That should be easy enough. I'll probably just do that. Golden neck chains. That has to be fine in raid. Courtesy this set. Jaeger. Survival is path, tough guy. Hmm, let's see. Measure two. So I killed all of them. I just need to do that. Okay. Please keep it out of the also probably two missing informants. Jammer, that's on the roof. West. Got a gold shine cargo. Sniper rifle skills. Kill Sanitar. Cool. Cool, cool. All right. Let's try to go visit the house then. Need armor. The helmet, a shotgun. I'm gonna call it here. This is a seven in the morning. Try to sleep a little bit more. Get up and be ready, and probably be back streaming in about. I didn't even get on seven hours. Take that one way. Take that, you know. We go to line. I should bring them so I can maybe do those two quests. Let's just put this on for now. Even though I should be running with a shotgun and kill scavs. Cool. Anyway, thanks for tuning in, watching the VOD, or what you're doing. It's appreciated. Up to catch some of you another time, you know? That'll be it for me for now. I'll be back later. Hopefully, I'll get to do some runs with uh, patches. That would be cool. 
have not. I'll just run solo. I gotta get used to. I gotta start getting into more action. You know, get into more fights, get more used to, to fighting. I definitely gotta do that. Yeah. So, you, uh, yeah. I already said goodbye, so.